pictures tonight. The Erie County Sheriff's Department is on the hunt for whomever is responsible for vandalizing construction equipment at the new Black Rock Canal Park. Investigators say that that equipment, worth tens of thousands of dollars, has either been stolen or it's been destroyed. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Kendra Eaglin, live in Black Rock tonight. Yeah, Keith, this is the fourth time in this month alone that vandals have come into this park and completely wreaked havoc on the park, including some graffiti on the sign you see behind me. I can tell you that since we've been here on the scene since about 4.30 this afternoon, we've seen three separate police patrols, and you can bet that police are going to continue to increase those patrols. This latest incident happening over Memorial Day weekend, Sunday night into Monday. Officials tell us that vandals stole a construction equipment smashed out windows and construction vehicles and even shot out some lights with guns. The suspects caused a total of $30,000 in damages and losses. People we spoke with today say there needs to be more security here. They won't pay nobody no $30,000 at Washington. They don't pay them that much. But you know what I'm saying? So what do you want, security, or you want your stuff to be taken? We're trying to do the right thing and turn that area into a beautiful showcase place. And we have a group of individuals just causing chaos. And these are criminals that are coming out and causing damage to the parks. And in this situation, it's not just damage. Uh, they're actually stealing materials. They're stealing equipment. Officials are now considering adding Buffalo City cameras here at the park. Back out here live, the Erie County Sheriff's Department tells us tonight that they do have a couple of leads, but they're still asking the public for help. If you do have any information on these crimes, you're asked to call the Erie County Sheriff's Department Crime Stoppers Unit at 716-867-6161. For now, we're live at the Black Rock Canal Park. Kendra Eaglin, 7 Eyewitness News.